Hi, Neva Kid is here to present a great fresh way to immerse children into English more and make them listen. You know what I'm talking about, right? Podcasts. This form of online periodic audio publication has recently successfully replaced television, radio, press, and books. Podcasts are easily available around the world and mostly for free. And we only need a smartphone with internet access to manage them. By listening to podcasts, learners can improve live speech comprehension, learn more real life vocabulary, get immersed and start thinking in English about things they've heard about in English. Sounds beneficial, doesn't it? Well, I think it definitely deserves a try. But here's what you should look at before choosing one for your child. Age and level. It might be difficult for parents to identify what is the level of your kid. Although you may try to listen to a few episodes with them and discuss it afterwards, there's no need to check for every word's comprehension. Just make sure the idea is clear and your child finds it more interesting than challenging. American or British? This point is important for very beginners. Pick one variant and stick to it for a while. English Class 101 You will find episodes for beginners and for advanced users. You can easily choose materials tailored to the level of your child's advancement. There is also a section with important information about the country's culture and the vocabulary and grammar issues used are discussed. Elementary Podcasts the entire podcast is quite long as it takes about 25 minutes, but it can easily become a daily lesson for your children. Each episode is based on role playing and discussing scenes that reflect typical situations in which we need the English language. Culips ESL Podcast. Our special love for this podcast lies in the way it provides both audio and study guides for each episode. You can find episodes both on vocabulary, pronunciation and real talk. Stories Podcast This podcast comes with a new bedtime story every week, which is a personal favourite because my kids don't go to bed without a story. You can find tales from all around the world, retellings of classics and unique stories. Everything is G-rated and safe for all ages. The perfect kids podcast for imaginative families. Little stories for tiny people. Little stories for tiny people is written, performed and produced by Ria Pecher. Her stories are cozy and warm, perfect for the before bedtime and car rides with children. Additional activity for it could be illustrating them with your child. This truly is a magical podcast. The English We Speak The podcast covers everyday phrases and slang expressions that occur naturally in the language. Each episode that lasts three minutes introduces a new expression with lots of examples and context. Luke's Podcast Luke's English Podcast is an award-winning audio show for learners of English as a foreign language. His goal is to make you laugh while you learn, and I mean who doesn't like to laugh, which in our opinion, he accomplishes very well. Brains on. The most fun science podcast with a new kid host every episode. In cooperation with Molly Blue, they find answers to fascinating questions sent by children all around the world. Kid news. Five minutes of today's top news stories, current events, politics, science, entertainment, sports, and more. All non-partisan and age-appropriate. Isn't that a perfect way for kids to keep in touch with what's going on? English Learning for Curious Minds English Learning for Curious Minds is where you can learn English from native speakers while learning fascinating things about the world. But why? A podcast for curious kids. Why is the hardest symbol of love? Do skyscrapers scrape the sky? 
children ask a lot of questions and this podcast most probably has the answer to any of them. Kids ask and adults answer in the simplest and most age-appropriate way. Learning a language is a complex process. Reading, writing, speaking and listening. One should develop each of these basic language skills evenly in order to have a solid language comprehension. Since most learners are not currently located in the target language spoken area, it is particularly important to focus on developing listening and speaking skills. And while Nova Kid classes with native speakers help drastically improve speaking skills, listening might take more out of class practice.